We've barely had time to catch our breath after a marvellous round of midweek matches and guess what? The Barclays Premier League has served up another spectacular day of action. And Jermaine Genus and David Moyes are here to enjoy it all with us. It's only polite to start with your former club, David. Uh, Everton were seeking a first league victory at Stamford Bridge since 1994 against a Chelsea side who'd gone five games unbeaten under Gus Hedink. Commentary comes from Steve Bauer. He's never far from the Chelsea headlines, but in Jose Mourinho's last 11 games, Diego Costa managed only one goal. Since, under Gus Hedink, he has four in four. And looking to halt his recent progress today is the man Chelsea tried so desperately to sign back in August. And John Stones is in the Everton team that again will look to the joint Premier League top scorer back at his former club who he's never scored against. Romelu Lukaku has 12 goals though in his last 13 games. Well read by William. Costa. Quickly trying to get Fabregas moving. Willian's off again, and he's on site. Here's Willian. Good save from Tim Howard. He did think momentarily about the cross for Pedro. Tried his luck himself. Good movement, well-timed run. And a save you would expect the Everton goalkeeper to make. He duly did. And here's Lennon. Chance to bring it forward for Everton. He's trying to find Barkley. He has. It's Ross Barkley for Everton. Only Lukaku in the middle, good block by Zuma, and it came to Oviedo. Onto his favoured left foot as well, he just couldn't steer it on target. Just fell nicely into his path, Courtois probably had it covered. He's looking for better fortunes today. His seventh Premier League visit as a manager to Stamford Bridge. He's yet to pick up a point here. This is Morales with a nice turn, and a decent shot, which forced Courtois into an equally good save. Really good turn to begin with for Morales. It was a clean strike too. Just the one Premier League goal so far this season. Good stop from Courtois. Just about keeping the owner awake. Barry. Nice interchange with Stones and then the early ball from Barry to Lukaku. Charging his way through Romelu Lukaku. He's found Barkley. Here's Baines, oh, and it was waiting and it's gone in, it's an own goal. I think it's John Terry got the final touch, but Everton are in front. And it was a really good break. Barry with the initial pass, Lukaku played a big part, big and strong. Awareness from Barkley, Baines is definitely onside, and as he drives this across, it is John Terry who couldn't deal with it. And the Chelsea captain puts through his own goal. Lukaku was waiting if he'd missed it anyway. It is Everton who have the breakthrough. And trying to clear it, he hit it against his other foot and into the back of the net. John Terry own goal, Chelsea nil, Everton won. It wasn't fouled that time, but Everton have it back with Morales. Into Barkley, shooting opportunity. And he went near post and he very nearly squeezed it in. Look at the space for Barkley, was well found. Roy Hodgson and Ray Lewington amongst those looking for more goal-mouth action. And that was just a little over-elaboration, Everton survived though. Here goes Barkley again. Terrific run from Ross Barkley. Is there a choice at the end of it? Lennon. He saw Baines available. Swept in towards Morales. Fine finish, Everton double their advantage, Kevin Morales back in the team and he marks it with his second Premier League goal of the season and Everton have put their stamp on this match, they were patient after Barkley's run in from Baines, one touch from Morales and the second was lethal and the Belgian gave his fellow countryman Courtois no chance whatsoever, he swept that home Lovely volley. Chelsea have it all to do to avoid their first defeat under Gus Hiddick. Arms folded. That expression tells you everything. Surely he's not texting somebody else. He's in his ninth managerial appointment since buying the club. That's Pilaqueta. Might reach Willian. Well won by Baines. The confidence of Barkley. Won back by the Diego Costa. Pedro. That's Pilaqueta in, off Fabregas, terrific stop from Howard. 
It's a really good delivery. Good improvisation from Fabregas, good reflexes from Howard. And that tight, tense first half. As a distant memory, it's open now as Costa gets through. And Diego Costa will pull one back for Chelsea. Everton will be disappointed to concede that one. Chelsea are back in it. Nothing more than a long ball from Fabregas. Jagielka lost the flight of it. Howard came to meet him and didn't get there. And Diego Costa couldn't miss. Jagielka was always struggling from that moment on. And Diego Costa has given Chelsea a lifeline. And they were in control there, Everton. They'll be bitterly disappointed to concede from that long ball. And this game is in stark contrast to the first half now. It's alive, it's open. Fabregas once more. Costa. Shooting opportunity for Fabregas deflected it in. From two down to 2-2. Two -two. And Cesc Fabregas, after 26 Premier League games without a goal, has his first ever goal at Stamford Bridge. What a turnaround. Two Chelsea goals in two minutes. The deflection took it away from Tim Howard. But Chelsea will accept that break off Besic. That deceived the Everton goalkeeper. That long, long way for a first goal at Stamford Bridge in his career is over. And it's back to Chelsea 2, Everton 2. A former midfield player who won the FA Cup four gus hitting for Chelsea at Wembley against Everton, watching on. Still Willian, eventually does find Kennedy. Costa waiting! Big chance for Diego Costa. Completely miskicked it. He got the right side of Funes Mori. Oh, what a chance. Lukaku. Early from Besic. Morales is in. It's Kevin Morales for Everton. Against the legs of Courtois. And a big chance at the other end. Well, credit Courtois for coming out quickly, but Morales will be a little bit disappointed. He's looking to lead Everton to their first league double today over Chelsea since Gordon Lee managed it in the 1978-79 season. And guess what that season? Chelsea were relegated. De La Feu, early cross from him towards Lukaku. Ivanovic stuck closely to him and concedes the corner. They've marshalled him well today, Chelsea. He got in between the two defenders, Lukaku. Headed away by Remy. Back from De La Feu. And turned in by Furness Mori, right on the 90th minute. Ramiro Furness Mori with his second Premier League goal, and it could be the winning one at Stamford Bridge. What late drama! The first corner caused no problems whatsoever. Then the second cross over Courtois, and Furness Mori on the stretch with his right foot guided it past Courtois. Totally unmarked, you have to say. He gambled, he didn't give this up. Cue the Roberto Martinez celebration. And Everton lead by three goals to two. There's one more piece of defending to do for Everton. Furness Murray beaten to it by Zuma. When it might come through to Terry! John Terry with the last kick of the game has levelled it up for Chelsea. We've played over eight minutes of stoppage time. Everton are furious, but the Chelsea captain, who scored at the wrong end at the beginning of the half, scores at the right one, right at the death. Suspicion of offside, but what a finish. A moment of improvisation from John Terry on his 700th career appearance. What a second half, and John Terry's goal, clouded in controversy, has rescued a point for Chelsea right at the death. A lot of teams.